We're here with Casey Kane, driver of the number five Great Clip Chevrolet for Hendrick Motorsports. Casey, season's almost over. How would you say your season went? What what kind of rating would you give you guys and your team? Uh, we've uh, we've came a long ways this year. We've you know I feel like the last twelve weekends, maybe thirteen, we've been a uh, you know a top twelve car mm -hmm. every single race, and and that's. Uh, that's been great from where we came from. We struggled more early in the season, just things we couldn't really get that balance, get that feel that I was looking for. And uh, just a lot of things didn't go our way because of that, but it was mainly uh, just speed that we were lacking. So I feel like we've done a, a much better job as a team all the way around in the last 12. And we have a lot to, you know, look at and use to, to work, you know, to work forward and be, be better prepared and do a much better job all, all next season. What are some of your goals for next season then? Oh, we want to win. You know, we haven't done that in a while. Yeah. Uh, we want to make the chase. We want to be consistently in the top 10 every weekend mm -hmm. and uh, start qualifying way better. That's, uh, I would say my first eight years in cup, I was as good a qualifier as anybody. You know, regardless of what team I was at, where I was at, what I was doing, we were still qualified really well had great averages uh, a lot of pulls all that stuff and we don't even come close anymore so that that's something that really needs to be worked on uh, that affects the entire the entire race it takes a long time to get from the 20s to the top 10 uh, you know and then have have an opportunity to lead laps and battle for wins uh, these days it's so competitive you need to start further forward so we need to really work on that before we get to 2017, we've got a little bit of an off season going. What are some things you're looking forward to to the off season? Well, first off, I'm looking forward to hanging out with my son Tanner, uh, whether it's on the weekend, the weekdays, uh, outside, just playing, doing things that he'll enjoy, and uh, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Hopefully, we have a good winter, and we'll see if he enjoys the snow or not. Uh, and then I'm going to go to Australia from uh, December 23rd or 25th, somewhere in there, until. Uh, January 5th, 3rd, 5th, somewhere in there. Race six sprint car races over there. Looking forward to that. And other than that, I'll just be in, uh, be in Charlotte, uh, you know, preparing for next season, you know, working out a lot. I, I enjoy that during the off season to so do a lot of working out and uh, we'll do some sponsor stuff to, to be ready to go next year also. So you're going to get this question. We ask a lot of dads in the garage. Do you see your son eventually going and racing, uh, not only in the Sprint Cup Series, but racing in general? I, I don't know. I think it's, uh, I think growing up around it, once, I mean, he's going to grow up around it. So as he, as he does that, I don't see how he's not going to want to race and want to at least try it. But it'll be completely up to him. I, I mean, I, I'm really happy that I played sports growing up. My parents wanted me to play sports rather than race. So I played sports for all the way till I was, you know, I think a uh, sophomore in, in high school. And I'm, I'm glad I, ha I did that. I think I learned a lot from coaches, uh, from just working hard and, you know, to, to be better, you know, to get better in, in certain areas. So I, I really like the sports side of things. I, I hope he wants to do that. But racing, I mean, if he's into that, then we'll, we'll figure out how to do that as well.